Hey, I'm Andy Allardort. In this edition of In Deep, I'd like to talk about the concept of drone strings. A drone string on the guitar is a wonderful technique to use, uh, wherein you pick one of the strings of the guitar, open, and then you use that usually as your tonic, as your uh, the key that you're in, the one, and then you can play melodies around on other strings while keeping the drone string ringing. And uh, it's, it has its roots in Indian classical music and ragas and sitars and stuff like that. You always hear that on a sitar where strings are, open strings are being hit and melodies are played ascending and descending the fretboard. So you always hear that drone string in there. So over the next series of uh, columns, we're going to address different ways to use drone strings for creating riffs and playing melodies. So we have six strings, and you could use any one of those strings as a drone string. I'd like to start with using the G string, which is a little unusual. It's more common to use one of the bottom two strings, the open low E or the A string. But let's use the G string. And before we get to the concept of playing that open G string along with melodies, we have to pick a scale to base our melodies on. So I'm going to pick the G mixolydian mode, which is just like G major scale, but with a flatted seventh degree. So here it is in second position. So those notes are G, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, and it repeats. So you may notice there's no sharps or flats, which makes it the same as a C major scale. So the way we're going to utilize this open G string is we're going to play those notes, G, A, B, C, D, E, F, easy to remember, no sharps or flats, on different strings while we play the open G string at the same time. So, just as a means of getting started, let's ascend the A string within the structure of G mixolydian. And I'm gonna just start with the low G note because we need a G on the bottom. And I'm gonna play all those notes of G mixolydian in pairs simultaneously with the open G string. And if you do that, you get this. So a nice thing to do is to play melodies on that A string along with the open G. So instead of just playing say something like that. I can play that with the open G at the same time and I would get this. Here's another example. And here's one more example. So it's very important for you to practice your G mixolydian scale on each string. We did it on the A string, 
I'll show it to you on the G string as well, and then try to come up with some of your own licks playing the G mix Lydian scale on the D string while playing the open G string simultaneously. <laughs> Here it is with the G string. Mm -hmm. 